Hey, it's Anna Marie from pulloverandletmeout.com. Here's my video about a visit to Denver, Colorado. Enjoy. I was in Colorado and had a short visit with my niece and our first stop we hit the ground running at Union Station. It's an incredible building and, and just a vibrant place in the heart of downtown. Then we moved on to Larimer Square, which is a really neat neighborhood with dining and shops. Great place to do some shopping, too. With over 200 craft breweries, of course we had to stop in at Epic for some craft beer. And that evening, we took a Twilight Ghost Tour with Best Tours of Denver. We saw some eerie things, heard some fascinating stories, Got a lot of history of the city as well, uh, saw some famous residence homes, and even one that's been featured on Ghost Adventures. Ooh. We were up bright and early the next morning to drive to Morrison, Colorado to visit Red Rocks Amphitheater. Not only a geological wonder and an awesome place to see a concert, but it's very popular with people who love to exercise there. The views are just breathtaking, so I highly recommend if you're in Denver, make a little drive out and visit Red Rocks. We departed Red Rocks and went to Denver Central Market, which is a really cool gourmet food hall. Had a delicious lunch and awesome salad. And after lunch, we went to the River North neighborhood, which is also known as Rhino. This is a really neat industrial area that's been revitalized and is now home to artists. There are art galleries, exhibitions, and tons of street art. And the day we were there, there was an art fest going on which was really awesome. It was an outdoor event with vendors, food trucks, artists, and you got to see some live artwork being done right in front of your eyes. It was really neat. And we concluded my stay in Denver with a visit to the Brown Palace Hotel. Built in 1892, it's an iconic landmark in downtown Denver and has been a place where famous people, celebrities, presidents have stayed. In fact, I think every president since 1905 has visited this hotel in Denver. It's a beautiful building. They have a lot of history there. You can learn about it. There's also an incredible afternoon tea. And although we didn't have reservations for afternoon tea, we did pop into the Ship Tavern and enjoy a lovely glass of wine at the bar and chatted for a while. It was a great way to finish out my visit in Denver, Colorado.